Welcome to a new RFS Instruments tutorial. EI Analytic Latest Update presents a new condition monitoring tool, SCADA Schemes. You can create different visualization dashboards from your cloud database and monitor your machine's health in a graphic and easy way. To create an SCADA scheme in EI Analytic, go to the database section and select SCADA. In the next window, click on New Scheme to create a schematic. On the left, expand your database tree and activate the checkbox to choose a machine or point to be added. On the right, pick an image from your computer. Click on Select Image and use the File Explorer to find it. Once you have chosen the point and loaded the image, click on Next. First, name your SCADA scheme. Below the name, you will see the loaded analysis points. Drag the point of your choice onto the image on the right to add the data in sections called Items. In the displayed window, choose what data you want to display on your item. Expand the sections to choose the parameters. For this example, we will choose temperature and velocity on the horizontal, vertical, and axial axis. In the style section, you can change the format of your generated item. In color, you can pick the text color. Choose it with your mouse and click OK. In background, you can choose if the item background will be colored or if it will be transparent. If you make the background color red, you can pick the color in background color section. Finally, you can select the font size. At the end, click apply to add the item to the scheme. Use the mouse to move the item to the desired location. And you can use the controls to change the square size as shown in the video. You can add as many items as you need in your schematic. In the timer section, you can choose how many seconds the data displayed in the items will be updated. Delete the selected option to add a new one. You can also manually update the data with the blue circular bottom in the upper right corner. Or remove all items with the delete bottom. You can edit a previously added item. Click on it and go to the status section at the bottom left to modify it. When you have finished configuring the scheme, click on Next. You will see a brief summary of the schema settings. If you're satisfied, click Save to apply the changes. To open the schematic, go to the SCADA section and click on the Scheme List. On the left, you will see all your previously created schemes. They will be under the machine or point you choose to add the data from. Expand the tree and open the scheme you want to monitor. With this tool, you decide how to view the data. Use a diagram, a stylized figures, or a simple picture of your machine. In Airbus Instruments, we keep improving to give you a better service. If you have any questions, please contact our technical support team.